the core beneath the museum is much older than this book. Um, however, this book is the oldest man-made item on site. Um, it was published in 1556 in Switzerland, um, and the author was George Agricola. Now, this is a Latinization of his German name, which was George Bauer. Um, he was well-grounded in the classics, had wide-ranging interests. He published several important books, but De Re Metallica is considered his finest and most endearing achievement. He was a brilliant scholar, was able to assimilate vast amounts of information, and, as a gifted teacher, was able to convey his, this in clear Latin. He was fluent in Latin. He needed to invent Latin words to express meanings for objects and procedures which he hadn't existed in classical times. The, the book took 20 years to publish, uh, mainly due to the illustrations which were done by woodcuts, elaborate woodcuts. And these uh, illustrations uh, are beautiful in themselves and show all sorts of mining, um, from extracting gold from sediment to illustrating women being employed, even people having their lunchtime snack. Every month we change the page, we call it turning the page, um, and we do this the first Wednesday of every month, um, and it, it takes all day. Um, in the morning we open the case and we close the book and put the case back on and leave it closed um, all day and then at the end of the day we pull off the case again and find another page to open to display its beauty and its illustrations. Um, hopefully we always try and find a different angle, a different page to where it was before to help ease the pressure on the spine. Um, and then we make sure that the supports support the book properly because it is so old. Um, and we put the case back on and we also put a cover on the case because we need to protect it from UV light as well.